It's Saturday morning. I believe it's the 23rd, but I could be wrong on that. Oh, I'm having the worst allergy attack ever because of the rain, and welcome to my vlog. Well, it's Saturday morning, like I said. Dog behind me jumping. Freaking dog. I just smoked my last Marlboro. I just killed that carton off that I bought in Mexico. We gotta go to my dad's in like 12 minutes, but we're gonna be late, because we gotta do some shopping. Today was a late start. Last night was a late night. I couldn't sleep. So, fun stuff. Oh, I feel like crap today. Oh, okay. I got emails. Awesome. Alrighty. Well, I'm going to get moving, get going, do stuff. I got to pick up smokes and, uh, I know, quit smoking at them. No. <laughs> I feel rough. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll check in after when we go do stuff. So, talk to you later. Alrighty, we're on our way to the mall. Talk to you when we get there. It's going to be busy as hell. I know it. Alright, well, we're down here at the mall, and it is packed. There's people parked way the hell over here. Probably because they got the garden center up, or it's because tomorrow they're closed again. And I'm not sure if they're closed on Monday as well, but... So Monday's only a federal holiday, which is why it affects me. So, yeah, we're gonna go in, buy some stuff and junk, and come back out as fast as possible. Alrighty, well, I couldn't really help my dad that much, because he really dickered up his plants. <laughs> But uh, he's been doing a lot of work. Oh, it smells like paint up here. But he's been doing a lot of work, so uh, I think I've shown you this, all the uh, hardwood in the living room. Hey, stay. And uh, yeah, that's looking really awesome, that's for sure. And we'll go see my old room. Yeah, we can't see it. Oh, oh, geez, I'm stepping on stuff. Yeah, so he's got this all hardwooded up and Looking all awesome. Smells like paint. Oh, that one's been done a long time. I've already, already showed you their room. Their room's all done. See Looking the blinds? Out. The blinds is that's... That's the blinds? Oh, those are the ones. The ones yeah. that I'm going to get? No, it's still open. <laughs> oh, and this is the last room he's working on. So, lays down his paper. Slaps down the tiles. Beats them up with a hammer. Oh my god, it works! And you put your door on and then we can come and get him over at the house so he can build my shit. I'm just saying. If anybody's wondering, there's a picture of my old kitty. His name was Poofy, because he's a real Poofy Maine Coon. But we ended up giving her, giving him up to a friend who really wanted a kitty because my allergies are too much. That's why I'm on these things, because kitty allergies bug me. And I adapted to Felix, but I couldn't adapt to him because we got him at four years old. But he's still alive, he's still happy. He's a kitty. Well, we just had a snack. We're probably heading her out soon, so I will uh, probably be able to film over there, but uh, we'll see what we can do. All right, talk to you guys later. Well, I'm just outside for a cigarette right now, and. That dog you hear barking is my neighbor's dog, it's not Oreo. Hoping tomorrow's a lot nicer out because I really want to do, I really want to drop the battery in the Trans Am and uh, see if she'll start and, you know, test out all the systems, make sure everything's working fine. Because I think on Monday I'm going to contact my insurance broker, get the car insured, go to the MTO, get the sticker, maybe dump a couple bucks of gas into it. I put that uh, fuel stabilizer in her last year, I don't know how long that stuff lasts. So I can imagine the fuel that's sitting in the tank is probably pretty nasty. But uh, top some, put some more gas into it. And see if we can get her to start. Take it for a rip. Fortunately, in that car, I don't have all the cool uh, mounts, so I'm gonna have to retrofit stuff in there to mount the cameras. Shouldn't be too hard, but and uh, yeah, I wouldn't mind starting to drive that guy. It's been two years since I've driven it, so it's been started in here and there, but it's never really moved. I've rolled the tires a bit, hoping I don't have flat spots on the tires. To be honest with you, because those sons of bitches weren't cheap. I think I paid 200 bucks tire. There's some uh, Fusion, uh, I'm not sure the brand name, but they're, the tire make is Fusion. My buddy Joe bought the same ones for his Mustang, but he bought the 225 50R16s. I bought the 245 50R16s. I just went a little thicker because that's what the, the car originally had, 245 50R16. So I just threw that back on it because I figured that was factory. Hoping everything still works fine on it, but I guess we'll find out when we take her out for a test drive and see if she's all screwed up. I know I gotta change that belt, but I have no idea what I'm doing for that. I know a lot of you out there will probably send me a PM telling me what to do, but my best bet is I'll probably have to watch a video on it or something, or maybe I'll get my mechanic buddy over and bribe him with beer or something just to show me what you gotta do to do that. And I also gotta figure out what belt to get because, uh, yeah, it's been modified because originally that car, belt number four, it's not the right one because we put a uh, air conditioner delete in it because originally the car had air conditioning, but it was the old R32 or whatever it was, the old 
the old style air conditioner and uh, Canadian Tire said well we got two choices here we can either a upgrade you for $3,400 to the R34A or B you, which uh, was the one I chose we can delete the air conditioning and put a different belt in and that there will not only give you a little bit more horsepower which I think it's like probably a half a horsepower it takes the cost for that was like 50 bucks so I was like plan B bud I don't need air conditioning I got power windows <laughs> just drop the windows and go for a rip right I'm hoping tomorrow's nice because I really want to do that I really miss the car it needs a bath like no other I just really want to drive it yeah we'll see we'll see last year's problem was the headlight motors were draining the battery in about a day that's been fixed bought new headlight motors for it and after I found out the Trans Am headlight motors were 300 bucks a piece doing a little bit of research I found out the Fiero used the exact same motor guess what I got two motors the left and the right for 70 bucks gotta love it brand spanking new can't beat that so anybody out there who has an 82 to 92 trans am now you know the headlight motors the same ones the fiero used so nice that pontiac kept all their poppy uppy headlights running the exact same part anywho we're supposed to be heading over to the girlfriend's parents house soon for uh the whole birthday bash probably gonna be some ice cream cake which is gonna go right through me so that's gonna be awesome <laughs> You guys thought I was gassy a couple days ago. Wait till I get a slice of ice cream cake into me. I'm going to explode. Like I say, I can't really film much over there. They don't like being on camera. They don't like being, me putting them on YouTube. So that's not a big deal. I might film the cake, at least. Because uh, those ice cream cakes are pretty cool. That's if they get an ice cream cake this year. I don't know. Last year I bought the cake. Because it was just for the girlfriend. But this year it's for the girlfriend and her brother. So I didn't bother buying the cake. But we'll see what it is. Either way, cake is cake, right? Ice cream cake just kills me. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna go back inside and see if she's ready and we're gonna pitter patter and get at her and I really want a Hortons because I got a friggin' headache due to caffeine withdrawal. Nice! So I'll talk to you guys later. Well, we just did dinner and the birthday cake. Oh, ice cream cake. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna be doing a lot of that tonight. You guys thought I was gassy a couple days ago? Well, get ready. Because I'm gonna be dropping bombs like no other. Oh, man. It was good, though. It was pretty good. But Jesus. That was a big piece of cake. Couldn't film in there, like I said, guys. They don't really want me filming in the house. So that's why I sneak outside for a cigarette and talk to you. So I have no idea what's going on tonight, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, I have a feeling tonight's going to be the night when my insides explode, though. That was a lot of ice cream. Oh, my cake was huge. Huge cake. And we got to bring the rest home with us. Awesome. Anywho, I just came outside to uh, have a cigarette and let out some back pressure. Oh, geez. As long as it stays gas and not solid, we're okay. Oh, there's another one. Oh, oh that was silent. Uh, anyway, guys, I will talk to you guys later. Alrighty, well, we're home now, so, uh, yeah. I have no idea what's going on tonight. Adrian said he was going to text me, but I haven't gotten a text, so I don't know what's going on. But we're home now. Just going to chill out, see what's going on. I feel like balls. Had an allergy attack, even though I was on the Claritin, but that usually clears up after a bit. Alright, well, we'll talk to you guys later. I just remembered I was talking about ice cream cake and some of you guys might not know what ice cream cake is. Luckily for you, we have a piece in the friggin' freezer. This, my friends, is ice cream cake from Dairy Queen. Check that monstrosity out. What you're looking at is chocolate ice cream, some graham cracker crap in the center, and then vanilla ice cream with icing and junk on top. If you're lactose intolerant like me, this type of a treat will probably kill you or your toilet. Oh man, uh, Dairy Queen, I don't know how many people have been to Dairy Queen out there, but they they use like 22% cream in their ice cream. And oh, since I've been home, I shit out my ass like four times. It's starting to not even look like shit. I'm just saying, it's, it's starting to burn. It's like eating a McDonald's all over again. Oh, I feel so rough. What? Oh, thought you guys were saying something. Anyway, I feel so rough. I feel like, oh, between that and allergy attack, I feel like a bag of smashed assholes. Oh, I've been thrown down a flight of stairs. Stomped on by a bunch of angry teenagers going to a Justin Bieber concert. Ice cream cake, you are the devil. You are the devil. Oh well. I'm gonna go outside for a cigarette and some fresh air, which kind of defeats the purpose of smoking a cigarette. And I'll talk to you guys later. Alrighty, well Adrian just contacted me and wanted to see if I wanted to do coffee. So I told him, why not? <laughs> so we're gonna head down to the Hortons. Oh man, my eye is shot. Uh, yeah, that's shot. Freaking allergies. It's leaking like a sieve too. Oh well, let's head her down. Maybe some caffeine will wake my ass up. Nah. Yes!
so sparkly. So as you all know, we're down here at the Hortons. And you're looking down at me at the Hortons. <laughs> Shut your face. Here is Christina Knight K. 22. 22 who is now not 22. <laughs> I've been 22 for a while. <laughs> there we go. Adrian at the J uh, 042. <laughs> And, uh, um, and yeah, this. Uh, there, yeah. the cat piss there. He's uh, the guy in my like, food there, and I get real pissed there. <laughs> and then I punch the cat right in his face with my fist in his face for him. Where he pissed. Where he pissed in his face. <laughs> cat piss. Adrian. Push me. That's really good. <laughs> so, uh, double vlogging all the way. <laughs> Sorry. Bye, <laughs> That's hot. Not that. <laughs> that. No, not that. This? Don't you wish your boyfriend was hot like him? I'm sorry. Well, it doesn't show right now because it's under no, no. the table, but. You suck. But, He's saying oh. that. You suck. Uh, I don't like you anymore. Uh, We're not friends. It shows. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's Joe's or something. <laughs> it's Joe's. Oh. It's Ooh. Joe's. At the Smoke time! Adrian's so happy because he's got a cell phone with ringtone. I'm sorry. With, ah, hot, with good ringtones. Damn straight. Copyright. Copyright. Oh, copyright. High speed pursuit. Oh, I don't want to pull over for the fuzz. Oh my goodness. Go outside for a We're going to go outside for a cigarette and see what's going on and why that guy didn't want to stop. I think this bubblegum machine done hit the jackpot, eh? Yeah, look at that. Sorry, Ossifer. I've been drinking all night. That's exactly what's going down now. Oh, he's, he's got the door open. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. He's, cool. he's hardcore. He's pissed. That's awesome. That was a long time okay, for him so, to be uh, So I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that buddy in the car is going to be getting a nice little <laughs> fine for uh, attempting to evade an officer. Uh, that's friggin' hilarious. He's probably going to have him say the alphabet backwards, and the guy's going to be like, alphabet backwards. <laughs> Tim Hortons, always Brian fresh Brian until Brian. it's not. Alrighty, well, that was our Hortons. There wasn't too much going on tonight. Just, you know, that cop pullover thing, which I don't know what the heck happened. Adrian got more footage than I did. Sounds like the cop just let him go. I don't know what he did wrong, but he sure didn't pull over on time, that's for sure. But uh, I'm heading home. Currently 2.30 in the morning. I'm currently low on washer fluid still. And there's ice possible now. Awesome. So, <laughs> should be a fun drive home. So I'll talk to you guys when I get there. I'm not going to bother showing the ride because uh, I just don't feel like it. Sorry. Bye. Alrighty, well, I'm home now. So I'm going to end the vlog here because it's pretty late. It's about 2.37 now. So i got to still edit and get this up to YouTube. So, if you didn't leave you like today's video go ahead and hit the like button because you know I really like it when you hit the like button. It lets me know you like the video and I really like that. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about anything you saw in today's video, go ahead and uh, leave a comment below. I'll be sure to answer. And until next time guys, keep on vlogging.